Oh, you're very kind. Thank you very much. Uh, welcome back to Wednesday's show with Danielle Lewis, with Christopher Biggins, and special guest Saskia Hamp. Uh, she's a uh, goofy Georgia and uh, Brooks and Neighbours. What's it called? Brooks Neighbours. <laughs> Every weekday, 1.45, 5.30 here on Channel 5. Hey. Just before we go on, James Cronin, one of our viewers, says, please advise Christopher Biggins, he doesn't always turn his phone off in restaurants. I was in the Harvester in Peterborough the other day. <laughs> Is that a restaurant? Yes, it is. I was there. I, remember I was in the, the harvest in Peterborough earlier this year when he used his phone to contact several dining partners as he'd arrived before they did. He does like an audience, though, as quite a few of the staff and customers had their photograph taken with him. And what you see on what you show is what you get in life. I personally would have provided a quiet meal, but hey, I'm just a grumpy old man. Uh, <laughs> I remember that he's absolutely right. He's absolutely right. Uh, you should be ashamed of yourself. I know, I should. Uh, I talking of being ashamed of ourselves, still to come this morning is seven year old wannabe beauty queen, Honey Boo Boo, who is a megastar in America. Is she possibly the most dangerous little girl on earth with her poor diet, her low rent values, and the Gob that would shame a 45 year old. 037 173 555, that's the number, whatever you're thinking. <laughs> but first, can you explain the Merida doll's astonishing transformation from brave to babe? Uh, because Disney has been accused of sexing up the spunky Scots heroine star of the animation movie Brave. In the film, uh, Merida refuses to marry a family rival uh, to bring peace to the clans. An amazing archer, she splits an arrow Robin hood style at the tournament where the local boys try to win her hand. She is strong, she is feisty, she is independent, and so was the original doll that came out last year. Oh, her head's gone round the wrong way. <laughs> Bow and arrow. <laughs> Uh, long career, I mean, just looks pretty much like Merida in, in the cartoon. But she has now been replaced by this one, part of the new Disney Princesses merchandise collection. She joins Jasmine from Aladdin, Belle from Beauty and the Beast, Cinderella and Mulan. And what they have done is they have widened her eyes, increased her bust, narrowed her waist, given her a sparkly off-the-shoulder dress with a statement belt and replaced her <laughs> weapon with a comb. And when we called Disney to ask why, they couldn't or wouldn't tell us. 110,000 Merida fans have since signed an online petition complaining about the makeover, saying that Disney has ruined their pint-sized feminist icon. Makeovers like this only reinforce the idea that princesses teach girls that love and popularity uh, only come from being pretty and having nice clothes rather than hard graft or principles. Now, you've seen the film, haven't you? Did you like the character? I did. I, I remember leaving the cinema with a, a sense of, like, good on you, Disney, for creating a character that's actually, like, a proper role model for girls and, and you know, had a bit of guts and, and um, you know, bravery about yeah. her. She was a really courageous... So what do you think of the new princess version? Oh, look, I think it's pretty gross that they've put out a doll like that. I mean, at the end but of the it day... It undermines the whole concept yeah, of the film. Yeah, it's just not necessary. And and you hope that people just will buy the original version as opposed to the new glammed up version, but it's a pretty... Uh, you know, Disney's obviously just trying to make it's a, a buck a of out of... Paper. Oh. <laughs> They the come standard with that. Is that what girls do? <laughs> the original version. <laughs> the other one hasn't got any toilet paper. Sorry, anyway, so no, I'm, I'm listening and it's very serious, but I just... No. Anyway, I didn't expect to see that coming out. <laughs> she comes with um, added extras. Well, I don't believe it's the feet. I mean, these feet, I mean, they, they literally... Oh. Uh-oh. They cannot stand She's on their own feet because the feet are wonky with their shoes on. Yeah. They've got dolls that can't even stand. Well, it's so that girls can put their high heels on and trot around. Daniela? I don't really mind. Do you honest. not? No, I, I just you don't think... think that sort of no, sends because out I the don't... wrong message that being pretty is more important than being strong. I think kids will see it's a doll, it's a doll, it's a doll. But I think that one is a lot cooler doll and this a lot one. cuter doll. And I think most girls would go for that doll over it's that like one Katie anyway. Moran, but with different colour hair. It's just cool. <laughs> she's cool. She's a bit tomboyish and she's. Yeah. And if anyone's seen the movie, you wouldn't actually think that that was the same. No, this one's character. sappy, isn't it? That one's boring. Yeah, yeah, this yeah. one's cool. So, so I think why most did they people change it? Why did they change one. it? Come on, then, Biggins, what's the theory? Matthew, you know how much I love you. You know how much I love the right stuff. I learned so much. I've learned that I might die from taking my <laughs> yeah, yeah. off. All sorts of things. I have no interest in this story whatsoever. <laughs> I'm sorry. It doesn't interest me. I don't care. So it's Money. queens, I'm... not princesses, for well, you, yeah? Well, they, 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 you know, it's, it's not an issue. It is an issue, because this is a very insidious, sneaky, sly way of telling girls you're nothing unless you're pretty. All right. And the film is about saying you should be strong yeah. and independent. All right, I prefer Good, the one in your, bad. your Good. left hand. I prefer the one in the blue this dress. One. Gorgeous you're she is. You're so... <laughs> Shallow. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> <laughs> 
Let's find out. I'm going to pull out this bow and arrow now. What, let's find out what you think of Merida the Brave and the transformation. Kirsty, which do you prefer? I like the pretty one. I know you <laughs> <laughs> no, I like both of them, but we can still buy both, can't you? For now. Yeah, so what's the deal then? You can have, you can have both. I'll tell you what, them. the interesting thing this one's about £12, this one's about £20. Ah. You get less yeah, doll for more money. On it. Eh? That's got glitter and better shoes. That's... Terrible hair, though. <laughs> yeah, terrible hair. <laughs> Come on, let's have the calls. Come on. <laughs>